In this video, we're going to help you stay on the winning side of the great 2023 AI battle. Adobe just slam dunked on Midjourney and every other generative AI art tool with their new AI additions to Photoshop. Here are six ridiculous things you can now do with it. Generative Fill When you first hear that, you probably immediately think to yourself, what does that even mean? Well, we've all been there, working tirelessly, dragging, adjusting, and dropping elements in Photoshop. And Adobe finally heard our cries, rose from their throne, and said, Lo, enough is enough. Introducing Generative Fill, a groundbreaking feature that turns the world of image manipulation on its head, spins it around, and kicks it over. Here's a scenario to get the gears in your noggin churning. You supply a text prompt to the AI, and the AI, like a digital sorcerer, takes your image and spins it into something extraordinary. It peers beyond the edges of your image, procuring missing details from thin air, expanding the artwork seamlessly, and bringing your wildest visual concepts to life. It's not just a leap forward in image editing, it's a true quantum leap. But the parade of innovations doesn't stop there. Oh dear, no, generative fill is not a one-trick pony. Alongside expanding and enhancing images, this feature generates image-based letters, creating an unexpected, unique blend of text and visuals. Picture sprinkling magic onto your text, watching as it transforms into a visually stunning masterpiece right before your eyes. Imagine creating a logo or typography design where each letter is a breathtaking image in itself, perfectly encapsulating the essence of your message. With Generative Fill, it's more than possible. It becomes an experience of blending artistry with imagination. And the result? Nothing short of extraordinary. Creators, you are no longer confined by the borders of your initial image. With Generative Fill, you can transcend these boundaries and voyage into previously uncharted realms of creativity. Embrace this magic and watch as your artistic vision takes shape in ways you never thought feasible. Release your imagination and allow Generative Fill to be your creative partner. Moreover, let's not forget about another crazy feature, editing with words. This update might have been introduced first, but sometimes the thrill gets the better of us. With this upgrade, editing becomes an enchanting experience thanks to text-based prompts. Think of it as discovering a hidden world of creative opportunities just waiting to be explored. The process is straightforward yet surprisingly effective. First, select an area in your image you wish to tweak. It could be something as transformative as changing an object's color or as magical as adding an image. Once you've identified your target, it's time to open the prompt box and witness the magic unfold. Enter your text prompt, your magical spell that unlocks the desired transformation. For instance, if you want to shift a model's hair from blonde to a sleek shade of gray, type change hair to gray. And behold, your command is executed with picture-perfect precision. It's a fascinating dance of words and images that revolutionizes how we enhance and alter our visuals. Another fantastic upgrade is that the AI can generate details for you. Often, we're left staring at a blank canvas or an incomplete piece, unsure how to fill in the blanks. But worry not, the AI is here to help. It uses its understanding of your image's surroundings to generate creative ideas. Consider this, you need inspiration for a piece you're working on? Instead of straining your creative muscles, you simply click on the magical Generate button. Instantly, the AI springs into action, filling in the details in your image. It's like having a virtual collaborator who offers fresh ideas and suggestions. This tool is a revelation, particularly for artists who adore abstract art or prefer to go with the flow of their creativity. It introduces a realm of possibilities, allowing you to embrace the unexpected. Unleash your imagination, collaborate with the AI, and witness your piece evolve into a breathtaking work of art. Or, in simpler terms, you can just have it fill in the blank. What's next? Oh, right, removing unwanted elements. If you remember the 10 million Google Pixel ads that Google ran, particularly the one where they talk about the magic eraser, well, this is that, but better, and you don't even have to get a Google Pixel. The Remove tool in the latest Adobe Photoshop is your salvation. Say goodbye to countless hours spent painstakingly editing out unwanted photo elements and then meticulously retouching the background. This tool handles all the hard work for you in a snap. Here's the gist of it. You have a photo, but there's something in it you want gone. It could be an object, a person, or even a small imperfection that entirely ruins the photo's overall beauty. 
With the Remove tool, you can make it vanish as if it was never there. It's akin to waving a digital wand, and poof, the unwanted element vanishes. But what about the background? No worries, the background remains as flawless as ever. No blotchy mess after removing something, no need to worry about retouching. The Remove tool ensures your background remains seamless and pristine. It's an absolute lifesaver, particularly for those who've had to endure the agony of meticulous photo editing. With the new Remove tool, bid farewell to frustrating, lengthy edits and welcome a simpler, more efficient way to achieve picture-perfect results. It's truly a revolution in image editing. Whether you're a seasoned pro or a beginner, this tool will transform your editing experience and lead you toward visual perfection with minimal effort. And pause. Guys, we'll be reading and replying to every single comment on this video, so please drop a comment down below. Tell us what you want to see more of and what you don't want to see, or just say hi. And of course, don't forget to like and subscribe to Performance AI to always get the most out of your tech. Another fantastic feature that deserves mention is the ease with which you can combine photos. Yes, you heard that right. Merging photos has never been easier. Adobe Photoshop's upgraded AI allows you to blend different images seamlessly, creating a stunning visual cocktail that's bound to leave everyone in awe. Just drag and drop the two photos you want to combine into Photoshop and hit the Generate button. It will then connect the two photos like two lost soulmates. The best part is that it will give you a few variations so that you can choose what looks best or which makes the most sense for what you're trying to illustrate. We love that because it's mindless. You don't even have to envision how the two photos connect. But here's why it gets even better. You can type a prompt, telling Photoshop what you want the final combination to look like. Then, like a magician, Photoshop will weave your separate images into a brilliantly blended photo that appears as if all the elements were originally part of the same picture that you masterminded through the prompt. This feature opens up endless possibilities for content creators and editors. It's a game changer, empowering you to bring together different elements and create stunning visuals that leave everyone in awe. The world of vector recoloring has also been revolutionized. This process involves adjusting color within a vector graphic. Unlike rasterized graphics, which are made up of individual pixels, vector graphics are based on mathematical formulas that define shapes and paths. This attribute allows for easy color adjustments and recoloring without losing quality or sharpness. Now, I'm no artist, so if you're like me, you had no idea what that meant, so in simple terms, basically, if you have a vector file, you can resize things infinitely and they won't lose quality. Like, if you've ever downloaded your profile picture from Facebook or something and then realize it's a really tiny photo, well, that's because it's not a vector. If it was, you could resize it as big or small as you want and it would still look crispy. As far as the tool goes, here's the simplified version of how this tool works. To access the Vector Recoloring tool, navigate to the Recolor Vectors section and click on the Generate button. Once you've successfully uploaded your image, you'll see a text box. This is where you can write a style prompt describing the color style you're aiming for. Photoshop will then generate multiple color schemes based on your prompt. You have the freedom to use one of these color schemes as is, or tweak it to make it perfectly match your creative vision. And those are six of the craziest things about Adobe Photoshop's new AI upgrades. What will be the first tool you're going to try out? Generative fill or combining two photos? Let us know in the comments. And of course, don't forget to like and subscribe to Performance AI to always get the most out of your tech.